Former President Jimmy Carter has made history with his 10th Grammy nomination at the age of 100. He was nominated in the Best Audiobook, Narration, and Storytelling Recording category for Last Sundays in the Plains, a centennial celebration. This achievement breaks records, making Carter the oldest Grammy nominee in history. The announcement was made by the Recording Academy, and the Carter Foundation shared the exciting news on social media. Released in honor of Carter's 100th birthday, the album features recordings from his final Sunday school lesson at Maranatha Baptist Church in Plains, Georgia. It also includes music by renowned artists such as John Batiste, Keb M.O., Leanne Rimes, Darius Rucker, and Nicole Zuridis. Producer Kabir Segal described it as the culmination of Carter's decades-long Sunday school teachings. The album touches on several topics, including the state of U.S. politics. Carter expresses a desire for presidential candidates to focus on peace, human rights, environmental quality, and equality, urging Americans to contribute to making the country a better place. Carter faces competition from other legends such as George Clinton, Dolly Parton, and Barbara Streisand in the same category. Although Carter is physically limited and in hospice care, this nomination is a source of joy for him and his family. His grandson, Jason Carter, highlighted the significance of this reflective period in his grandfather's life. The 67th Grammy Awards will be held on February 2, 2025.